Hi guys, let's see how I have made this dual disk drive with my existing pen drive. This is an old transcend pen drive that I am having and I'm, let me take it out and check what's actually there in it. Okay, here is the IC that it is having. There are a total of three ICs, two on one side and one on the other side. I have gathered some multi-core wire and then started soldering them. The basic idea is connecting these wires in parallel to the USB. I have connected these wires to the USB pin Once I am done with the soldering I have done the continuity test and I am amazed with the results everything was actually connected that was a bad soldering it's time to desolder the wires and again resolder them I have got the USB OTG cable and I have cut it into two pieces. These wires, the red one is the VCC, green one is data plus, white one is data minus and the black one is ground. So I soldered the corresponding wires and added insulation tape to them I have tested this but it didn't, really didn't work whenever I have plugged it into my laptop the on the pendrive blinked twice and stopped there and then my phone started charging up it's time that I change the idea took two double pole double throw switches and hooked up all the four wires coming out of that USB pen 
to these four poles of the two switches. On one side of the DP DT switches I have connected the micro USB cable and on the other side I have connected a USB jack. It's time to test the circuit and here is the laptop. And now I am connecting the USB to the laptop. First of all, I have hooked the micro USB cable, but the US micro USB cable that I have hooked didn't work on my phone. So what I did next is, I used the USB female connector that I have salvaged from that pen drive and connected it again in place of the OTG cable. And now to this female USB jack, I have connected an OTG adapter and then things worked fine. So you can see now that the USB is already disconnected uh, using the OTG connect cable here. The pen drive has switched on. So I then started to shrink the circuit. I have cut the wires and joined them together. And this is what the final product was. Thank you for watching. Hit the like button, comment, share and subscribe to my channel.